finally came. So, Aquarius, it's your turn. Somebody happy about something? Somebody happy about something? I hope so. I hear some good news. Somebody's happiness. Retired. You're hired. What's up, Aquarius? I feel like I ain't seen y'all in a minute. Two, two, two on the timer. Like, have I short, have I short changed y'all on some reading? I don't think I have. I'll check. I don't think I have though. Ooh. Spirit, please bless this new deck that I have. Please clear out any old energy that may have been stored in it from the packaging or creation. Clear it out. In Jesus, my name, please bless Jesus from the comments, so is my feet, and full body armor of God. Pray over this channel and over Aquarius or any cross washer that comes to watch this channel or receive messages from this channel. In Jesus' mighty name. Please give me clear and concise messages for the sign of Aquarius. I'll send back any evil eye or spell work that's been sent towards me or Aquarius or a cross watcher. Send back times a thousand to the sender in Jesus' mighty name. I pray. Amen. think these cards are going to wear out like the last ones, uh, even if they're broke, when I break them in. Four, four five, six on a timer.
Let me uh, open my sliding door because it's hot up in here. A new day. So, sun was on the other bottom of the deck. The pool is on this bottom of the deck. So was somebody t happy because they're about to take a leap or something? Oh yeah, these ain't gonna wear out. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. These are freaking. Beautiful. Look at that. Ooh. All right. Let's get it. Let's get it. Alright, Holy Spirit, knock any energy that was in this deck out of this deck. And fill it with my energy only in the energy of whatever sign that I am reading at the time. Heavy. to shuffle and ease a little. Got a little weight on me. I like these ones though. Alright, Holy Spirit. Open the lines of communication for uh, 
Aquarius. Just show me what's going on, please. Thank you. People showing fake love to me, straight up to my face. So did somebody realize that uh, they were surrounded by some vultures? Sound like it. Two more. Somebody's been doing some introspection, some healing, some going, going in, 12, 12 on the timer. Okay. It's a reflection on the card. Like, like enlightenment's been had, right? Like the light bulb just went out. That's dope. Anyway. Here we go. said stands in the beginning, right? Somebody is taking a leap of faith. They're happy about it. They're excited about it. Uh, so it's going to have some type of enlightenment, some type of uh, epiphany, maybe even a come to Jesus moment. I don't know. Okay. King of Cups. Queen of Pentacles. Somebody sees you as abundant. I'm feeling from my intuition that this person has had, they've been shown things about you they, through their intuition, through dreams. Um, God has been revealing you to them. Okay? That you are their gift. Okay? Vice versa. 14, 14 on time, that you're each other's gift. All right. Tori. Mm. Sorry, y'all, little Tori. I got a little, <laughs> got a little crash on Tori. <laughs> These cards are pretty. Let's be a past life soulmate, okay? <laughs> Damn, 
I, you know what? I don't even have to look at all these. Just the way I'm feeling, the, the, the way the deck is feeling in my hand, is that this is like the cream of the crop. Like, I feel like the match things, but I feel like the uh, the eclipse and everything that's been going on in the heavens is it. It, it was. Okay, yeah. It was rearranging everything to line this up, right? Everything had to go around in this place and, and move directly in line, right? In order for something to move, okay? Somebody may be bringing you flowers, okay? Or if this is you, bringing somebody else flowers, all right? Um... Six of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Equal give and take. Okay. Somebody's been reminiscing uh, about you, been in nostalgia about you, and about this connection. This person may have. This person may have even been celebrating with friends about this connection. I don't know, something that they, some conclusion they've reached, right? Uh, or people are happy for them, specific people. Um, not everybody, but there's specific people that are happy for them. Or this is you, like I said. What's this Ace of Cups? And uh, three cups. Good. My birthday may be in November. November months. Or be from between Halloween and uh, Thanksgiving. Maybe Christmas as well. Tower. So something is going to shock you. Seven of Swords, Judgment, and Temperance. I'm not getting, I'm not getting anything bad from the Seven of Swords. I'm getting a surprise, something or or something that you don't expect. Okay, something coming out of left field, something that you probably thought was dead. This person may have to get get rid of some old people, right? I mean, these people in this tower look like they, they was, somebody threw their ass out the threw their ass out the tower, you know, 1919 on the tower. <laughs> Lightning striped that tower. person also had a tower in their emotions, okay? Uh, they may have been, just the fact that they were holding their emotions back, that they have for you, right? They reached a point to where they bubbled over, okay? Seems like this person, like, oh, too many. Seems like this person was waiting I don't know if they were waiting or taking their time or taking too long. Um, you haven't appeared yet, but I'm feeling like you got tired of waiting for this person. No communication. No anything. Like this person could have even uh, like blocked you. I don't get that you blocked them. Sorry, y'all. Popping the gum. My bad. <laughs> I know that's annoying. Uh, 
but somebody could have, um, or not could have, they've been watching you from afar, okay? And, um, they've been nervous that somebody else is going to come along and offer you what they didn't offer you, okay? Or what they couldn't offer you at the time. <clears throat> I'm getting like a, a second chance type. I'm looking at this Ace of Cups and Spirit's taking my attention to this dove over this cup that has this coin in its mouth, this pentacle in its mouth. It's just coming by and just dropping it in the cup right there. And I don't know why that gives me second chance energy, but um, that's what I heard when I looked at it, so that's what I'm going with, all right? All right, so Knight of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. Holy Spirit, what's this tower? Do that again, because I don't know which way that was. Eight of Pentacles. What's Eight of Pentacles? Emperor, bottom of the deck. 2211 on the timer. This person could be an Aries or they have Aries in their chart. I swear, I keep the Aries keep coming up in these in these uh, other readings. Uh, they could be a water sign as well. I didn't know there was two blank cards. My bad. No. Nine of Wands on the bottom of the deck. Strength card. Nine of Pentacles. Page of Swords. So she is watching. So this person's been behind it while they haven't been talking to you. This person's been actually cleaning their life up, right? Um, to match more with yours, okay? They've been watching you while they've been working, right? But they've been working hard and diligently. Confirmation there. Uh, they've been working hard and diligently, okay? Um, they may have been working on their money as well, their stability. Um, this person was having, gaining strength, right? They were staying strong and, um, working up enough courage, right, to come towards you, okay? Um, I'm getting the, the, the picture of, like, a mother bird, right? Like, nesting for, for her. What do you call baby birds? I don't know, but... Let's just say, let's just say a, a mother, period, right? You know how it, from the animal kingdom to human beings, right? Same thing. When you're about to have a baby, right, you, you, you nest, right? You get your environment ready for that baby to arrive, right? And this is kind of what that person was doing, okay? Um, so it seems like they have some type of plan deeper than just... Offering you a casual conversation or, uh, you know, reigniting you two speaking to each other again, okay? They have some definitive plan to offer you something with action behind it. And it's like they've been keeping an eye on you to make sure that you don't walk away or that somebody does not 
intercept, right? Step in, but step in between what they're trying to accomplish, right? Which is to court you. This person's been watching you like crazy. Just strengthen this page of uh, page of swords. I don't want to say that. I don't want to say that. Do you have to say that, Spirit? Okay. So the 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 night of the excuse. I, look, I'm I'm blushing, bashful because I don't want to say it. The Ace of Wands isn't out here, right? But there's this. This person watches you a, a lot, and they pleasure themselves to you, right? But not in a creepy way, like, in a way like they're looking at you like their wife or their husband, right? Whichever pile the way goes. But Spirit <laughs> made this apparent to me, right? Yeah, the tower looks like an explosion. Okay, yeah. That's, that's, You guys may be sexually frustrated. I don't know. I mean, I can, <laughs> I concur. You know, people tired of being on, waiting on the horse. You know, waiting on the horse to to bring your knight in, or king, or emperor, whatever. All right. This person's going through something, okay, maybe through a divorce, okay, um, they've been guarded, keeping quiet, um, about something that they need to tell you, or been wanting to tell you, okay, uh, Nine of Wands, and the Moon card, King of Swords, All right, girl, what's next? What's next? What's next? Oh, come on, bro. Hold on, y'all. I gotta use the shuffle on these damn these are the heavy cards. Goodness. Minding your business, getting your pinnacles on, right? Getting to the bag. Some of you may build an, may be building an online business or uh, starting some type of business. Don't have to be online. Uh, but there's not a pentacle touching this eight of uh, pentacles and this tower touching this three of cups. You're gonna hit this pinnacle of success. Of success in this business or whatever it is that you're you know that you started you're gonna hit this pinnacle of success beloved and it's gonna be like a well of water that does not want to run dry okay your money's gonna work for you instead of you working for your money all right you're gonna be able to travel if you want okay it's gonna have financial freedom Chariot. 
this looks good. I'm sorry, I can't help but say that. This this looks good. Like what I was saying at the beginning. When I had the deck in my hand before I drew. This. I, I'm, I'm ready. The energy's starting to pick up now. Like it feels good. Man, whoever, whoever this is for, boy. I feel like this natural high. <laughs> that I'm feeling like I feel dopamine being released in my brain right now like literally those of you that used to smoke marijuana it's like when you first hit the blunt right and then the, the high comes over you that's what it feels like right now <laughs> so whatever this is okay that's about to be revealed to you that's what it's gonna make you feel like right you're gonna have like this natural high uh, this this dopamine hit, right? That's gonna hit you, and it's like whew, you're gonna be on cloud nine. We're like, ooh, ooh, damn, it feels good. It feels good. It feels good. Mm. Good God, I never felt that like that before. Not in the reading. So somebody may uh, become famous overnight, okay, for some of you, or one of you, somebody's about to have an overnight success, okay, and I don't mean overnight success like uh, this person didn't work hard, right, to get there, I mean this person's been working hard, this is you, or the other person, but I really feel like it's you, you've been working hard for a long time, right, ooh, she make it, you've been working hard for a long time, right, and um, like I said before, you're gonna hit this pinnacle, right, of success. You like hit this mark or this this burst of energy comes in for you, right? It's like uh, the eclipse, it's from, it's from the eclipse, okay? This burst of energy came in or is coming in, okay? And overnight movement. movement okay your subscribers your 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 viewers is gonna pick up 33 33 on the timer everything's going to pick up beloved like it is going to shock you all right it's gonna shock you so get ready for the attention okay congratulations whoever this is for congratulations I see you've worked hard for it okay this is nothing that's being handed to you or, um, you know, you, 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 you got it out the mud. That's what you deserve it. So congratulations, all right? You looking real good, real good on stage. Okay. Finest wine. Okay, you got suitors. You got suitors everywhere. Okay, uh, you got people celebrating, toasting to you. Uh, I feel like all the, uh, your haters, right? Of course, they're still hating, right? But I feel like none of their energy is, is like, present, right? I can't feel it. It's like... Um, the light from your success, right, is like blinding and pushing them and their energy out of the way, right? Well, you're going to be so happy. You might have a baby. Somebody might be uh, become pregnant as well, okay? I'm seeing, what what is that? Sex tuplets? Is that what it's called? Six tuplets? Six kids? Six tuplets. Somebody's gonna have six tuplets. Congratulations. <laughs> Alright, Spirit. What else?
Who else is attached to this fool? Who is this fool energy? Is this them or is this just them taking a leap and bounds in their career? Five of Cups, Four of Pentacles, Nine of Swords in the reverse. So this is bringing you out of a tough time, okay? Maybe something you were holding on to, someone, uh, a situation that you uh, either was waiting to come back around or <sighs> I'm feeling you were just having hope in something, okay? Um, Something was keeping you up at night, okay? And it doesn't have to be a person. Could have been about your business. Could have been about your business for some of you. I'm hearing spirits say, um, you surrendered. You surrendered is what happened, okay? And to be totally honest with you, that's what all these cards scream. Together, especially together. Surrender. All three of them together surrender as soon as you surrender things started to flow okay uh, I'm gonna put those over here good job Aquarius So, where are you going to go, Holy Spirit? Okay. It's a chariot. <clears throat> uh, chariot touching the page. there's somebody specific in this group of people watching you it's not all uh, admirers well customers I guess that's a lot of cards give me give me come on it's too many too many too many page swords and chariot Wheel of Fortune. Somebody's heartbroken that you seem to have moved on, or a cycle was ended with them. This could be a group of people as well, I'm picking up for some of you. This could be one person for some, for others of you, this can be a group of people, okay, that you left behind. Yeah, that you left behind from your past. of people that you left behind from your past that are heartbroken. Three of swords, eight of cups, six of cups, the death card.
okay? You cut your losses, okay? You let go of things that did not serve you anymore. Um, you let go of mindsets or people, places or things that were holding you back. All right? What did I say up here? You surrendered, right? You surrendered. That's what happened. You surrendered, okay? As soon as you surrendered, everything just started to flow, right? You surrendered to God. Okay? Surrender to God and to the process. Alright? Thank you, Spirit. That was as clear as day. Well, this card is pretty. Predicted today. All right. Uh, wait, 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 wait. This. Where you want me to go? <laughs> I keep feeling this single energy. This. Person. Oh, boy, that's what I'm I keep feeling this single person energy. Uh, could be an ex. Don't have to be. Could be a brother, sister, family member. Let's see. Who's who's who else is hiding? Who's hiding behind this page of uh, swords? High priestess in reverse. Somebody that was against you. Somebody trying to manipulate. Manipulate what was going on. Somebody was trying to manipulate God's purpose over your life. Knight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands, Queen of Swords. So you could have an on. So whatever this business is, I'm getting for some of you. It definitely is an online platform. Okay. All right, and this High Priestess in the reverse. Has been sending bad energy, okay? Spell word, whatever you want to call it. Been sending it towards you, okay? Spirit said, trying to keep you from letting go of the things that I spoke to, spoke about earlier that you let go of. This person was trying to keep you from detaching from people, places, and things, okay? Which was holding your progress back. Okay, but you you let go, right? You have breakthrough. So what's up with this high priestess in the reverse? Who is this? Who is this? Somebody who's dazed and confused. I just heard baby witch. Tonight. All right, Holy Spirit. Who's this? Who's this? Uh, priestess in reverse. Who's this? Who's this? That was violent. Ten of Wands. Okay, we another one. Swords. I joined the U.S. Air Force at a young age. It helped shape me as the leader I am today. But after eight years, I was ready for a different kind of approach. So this could be a, a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Okay. I was ready to see my daughter. Ten of Swords could have paid this High Priestess in reverse to put more burdens on you. Okay. Whatever 
this person tried to act like they were for you when they were against you the whole time, right? And you know what's crazy? My bad, sorry, Juju. What is trippy to me right now? Like, okay, so one of my exes, right? The 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 the, the, the psychopathic one, the 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 nutso, right? He used to he he used to he was a Scorpio, right? He used to do this thing where he'd be sitting right next to me on the bed, right? And he'd be looking at me at the corner of his eyes like this, right? But with such an evil, evil <laughs> confirmation. That's look at it with you. That's the same thing. He's same way he's looking. Look. Same way. Ain't no coincidence that this is a Scorpio Cancer Pisces. So this may be a Scorpio for some of you, okay? That's responsible for this. This person has a lot of burdens on them right now, okay? For doing this, and and for doing a whole bunch of other things, right? Not to, not to just you, but mostly yes to you. Right, you were you were where it stopped. Right, the buck stops with you. Ten of swords on the bottom of that. Forty-seven, forty-seven on the timer. So this person, damn, I didn't even ask nothing spirit. Huh? This person's in confusion, okay? Because nothing that they have been trying to do has worked. All right, this person. Page of cups. <laughs> this person thought that they were getting away scot-free, right? They thought that nobody could see them, what they were doing, right? There's five of swords here, right? There's two swords on the ground here, okay? Okay, and that's speaking to me, to me right now, that's speaking of evidence, okay? Some evidence that was left behind that somebody has. And now this, this has this person all up in their head, okay? Because they've been caught. They've been caught. Baby, they've been called. Mm -hmm. This could be that King of Cups that was uh, dream hopping last night. I just heard dream hopper. I promise you, I did. Dream hopper. Astral projection. Spiritual rapist. Shocked me so that I'm scared the crap out of me. Did what I just say? Dream hopper, right? Spir spiritual rape. By God, if the cars don't say that. Dream hopper, spiritual rapist. Dream hopper, spiritual rapist. 49, 49 on the timer. Goodness. Your family may be involved in this too. Your family may be involved in this too. They've been found out, okay? Whatever happened, it's been found out. These people are losing. They're losing. I'm hearing property, money, okay? I've heard these things belong to you anyway. They were never theirs to begin with. Somebody may have been living in a house that was left to you. Okay? Sleeping in a bed. For some of you, it's a house that you grew up in. That somebody somebody passed away and left you a house. It's the house that you grew up in. And these mother... They was living in it. The devil is a liar. There ain't no truth in him. It was a murderer from the beginning. I'm hearing they getting at the devil is uh the enemy, Satan, is chomping on them. Chomping on them, having a field day. Thank you, Spirit. So this person. This person didn't like the fact that you were just ha a happy person, right? That uh, you were fav. <clears throat> I'm buying a rebuke. <laughs> I'll spill where it sits me and send it back to the sanitizer thousand. Jesus, my name, amen. 
this person did not like the fact that you were blessed by God, right? That you were favored by God, okay? They felt like because God favored you and loved you that God did not favor them or love them, which is not true, okay? This person doesn't even seek God. This person doesn't talk to God, all right? They just saw you and your relationship with God, and they didn't like that, okay? So they took it upon themselves to go and take a leap all over here, okay? Or, or on, on the hymn downstairs, okay? And figure, since you were with God and God was with you, that he can summon the devil to be with him to go against you and God. I know, stupidest thing ever heard, right? Right. Uh, but this is what this person did. Okay? And now the devil has come to collect. And he's laughing while he's chomping on this person. Chomping on this person. This person's whole life is flipped upside down. I mean, people have turned against them. Okay, the same people they gathered together to go against you have flipped, turned against them. Some of those people in that group are, enact, are enacting vengeance upon them for you. Right? Well, that's how they're looking at it. 52, 52 in turn. Thank you, Spirit. They're enacting vengeance on this person for you, okay? As a way to try to feel better, I guess, for, for going against you, okay? For believing this person. Even in going against you, beloved, these people knew that you were not the type of person that this person described you to be. They knew it. They knew it. Everybody looked at you like a, a goody two-shoes, like, uh, like God just gave you everything that you wanted, or... or uh, like you, like you were born with a silver spoon in your mouth, right? Which is, which is not the case, right? And even if you were, so what? So what? That's your plight, not anyone else's, right? Even if you were born with a silver spoon in your mouth, it's not like you didn't have your struggles too. Just because it, it wasn't in a specific area that theirs was in does not mean anything. But you were not born with a silver spoon in your mouth, okay? Take it how it resonates. For those of you who were, it is what it is, right? To make anybody no better or or any worse or least, okay? This person is being devoured from the inside out, okay? This is all intuitive coming in. This person is being devoured from the inside out. They're upset that you're still happy. They're upset that you're still content, right? Why? Because God ta taught you to be content in whatever whatever place in life that you found yourself in, no matter if you were at your highest high or your lowest low, or anywhere in between, God taught you how to be content wherever and whenever or whatever part of life that you're in, whatever level you're on, whatever part of your journey that you're, that you're on or in, God taught you to be content Okay, thankful, appreciative for the good and the bad. You learn these things. This person doesn't know that. These people didn't know that. They judged the book by its cover. And now they're being judged. 5505 one time. Ooh, thanks, very Good, good. Goodness. Just took over there. All right. Queen of Swords. Okay. Abundant joy. This inference looks chunky like she been, not chunky like heavy said, but like healthy like she been eating. Her table set. Okay. This person's mad because they can't sit with you. A lot of these people are mad because they can't sit with you. Which is crazy because they ostracized you at first. They act like you, like you had coonies or something. Oh, they can't sit with us. Oh, they did, did this and that. Now they want to sit with you at show table. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Ain't, 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 ain't enough room. There's extra chairs, but the, but there ain't enough room. Not for them, man. No. I'm hearing the uh. What is it? I was listening around, know the number, but there were like, what was it, five wise virgins? 
and five foolish virgins, right? The wise virgins did what they were supposed to do, right? Worked hard and filled their lamps with oil, right? It's their anointing. The foolish virgins partied all day, right? Messed off all the time, right? Didn't do what they were supposed to do. And they didn't have enough oil in their lanterns, okay? I'm paraphrasing here, okay? Didn't have enough oil in their lanterns, right? So they're asking the wise virgins, hey, can you spare, can you spare some of your oil or whatever? Because, you know, we only have a little bit of <laughs> Like, uh, no, girl. <laughs> no. We cannot. We worked for this. We need all this oil. Okay? I don't know what to tell you, right? So those of you who know that story from the Bible, right? You know what I'm talking about. These are the, the foolish, okay, unwise virgins, okay? They manifested this for themselves. Okay? And you manifested what you manifested for yourself. Alright? I'm going to put that in the middle because it's universal right here. It's universal. God, these cards are so pretty, boy. I tell you, look, look, look. Look at that. Just look at it. Ain't that pretty? Look at, look, look at it. That's the, that's the I'm sorry. I just did that. It's 57, 57 on the timer. Eight of pentacles. I mean, eight of cups on the bottom of the deck. Took me so long to get started. Uh, opening this new deck and all that junk. Alright, so uh, what's next, Spirit? What's up with this? Uh... Wait, where are you? Let me see. <laughs> Say it again. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Okay. Somebody wants to protect you. If somebody wants to reveal something to you, how they feel. Okay, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's a person that's been uh, blocking, trying to block out how they feel for you, okay? Um, or, I guess, figure their feelings out, all right? They want to offer you um, a proposal. Like, when, as soon as I put the card down, the card is a little lower than the other card. They're not lined up, right? And so, so as soon as I put the card down, I heard proposal, right? And that's, that's exactly what it looks like. It looks like he's on one knee, or he's lower than she is. Doing like this, off from the pinnacle. It's a proposal, okay? And lo and behold, after this is revealed, the Four of Wands. Mm hmm. About some, uh, maybe some sneakiness in the past or something that went on behind the scenes that either both of you didn't know about or one of you. But what's this Nine of Pentacles here for, though? I want to make sure they're here for. Not for the bag, you know, this, 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 this overnight success. Okay. What are they here for? Spirit. Are they here because they love my collective? Or, or, or my, uh, query, excuse me. Or collective, depending on who the cross watcher. What they here for? What they here for? Knight of 
passionate about you? Okay. What else? I mean, shit, I can be passionate about. <laughs> Lawrence is on fire all the time, but, but, but people can be passionate about anything and anybody. What else? Give me one more. care about you. They got they got emotions for you, okay? Not a cuts. Alright. Real passionate about you, okay. Emotionally and otherwise. Okay. You wanna collaborate? Partnership. They're a little guarded. They're a one be warrior. They've been through some things, but they See you as the one that they want to get to. Hmm. Oh, look at that size. Pretty. Look at her. Ah, can't get over it. Can't get over it. Okay. So. You may have a choice between two people, okay? Or three. We got eyes on you right now, a lot. So, you're gonna have a lot of suitors, all right? But there's definitely three people out here. <laughs> you just holding your bird like this, like, um, I'm not even paying attention. <laughs> He's thinking, not even looking. Okay. So, what else do we need to know for Spirit for you in this? Um, nine of Cups. You will be happy. You'll be emotionally fulfilled, content. Okay. God is making sure of it. So I was looking at uh, the card that represents God for me, right? I was looking at that card and it was uh, this this nine of cups came out. What the hell? How many blank cards are in here? Clean slate. That's what I just heard. Clean slate. Blank card. Clean slate. I'm going to leave that in there. So, you get a fresh new start. Fresh new start. Fresh abundant new start. Okay. Emotionally content. Like there's no, it's foolproof. Look, eight of wands on the bottom of the deck. Foolproof, right? Your intuition's popping. All right. Your, your, your star status is shot up okay whoever's reading this is oh my gosh oh my gosh it's like foolproof it's foolproof it is foolproof this is this is beautiful okay besides the, even the cars this is beautiful I, I, there's not literally nothing wrong in this in this spread. Nothing. Nothing. So congratulations, Aquarius. I'm gonna leave it right there because there's nothing else needs to be said. Uh, 
Congratulations. like you got a eight hour job eight hour a day job I'm changing because I met you okay so one that, that one of these people could be somebody uh somebody that you met somewhere and caused a change to happen in their life right I mean that is that is a part of your uh, you know what God sent you to do right wake people up somebody named Jay Lynn J A Y L Y N N I knew exactly what I was doing. That's that Scorpio over there. The Pisces Scorpio Cancer. The Psycho. Psycho. What'd I say? What'd I say? Cancer. Cancer. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm jealous because of the attention you get. Yeah, we know that. We know that, you emotional preacher, you. Sagittarius, okay? That could be in your chart. Uh, could be in this person's chart. Could be one of these new people. Uh, well, there's a king of wands there, so. It's like a name Michelangelo. Or some have something to do with uh, art. You see number 444. You see number 1010. You see number 333. Uh, Tennessee. Be from Tennessee, move from Tennessee, moving to Tennessee. You can be seen in number one, two, three, four. I'm emotionally abusive. Okay, so we all know who that is. All right, so leave that person where they're at in the past. All right, um, because they are in captivity for certain. Okay, that's it, Aquarius. I love y'all, beloved. I'm glad I got to use my first, I mean, open, use my deck with y'all first. Right, um, but I'll holler at y'all later. All right, this look good. This look good. This look good. You get, you get, you got the money, the business. You got a man or or, or a few, okay, to choose from or or, or women, okay. Now, whatever your your taste is, your forte is. Uh, you 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 start a new cycle. All right, abundant cycle that's gonna make you emotionally content, okay. Um, and I see no issues, none, none. Not saying life is gonna be perfect, no, but we, you know that already. But as in these cars, pfft, ride the wave. All right, ride the wave. I'll let y'all later, beloved. Peace.